Ang karunungan ay kapangyarihan. Now let's put that power to the test. It's time, time for K-Check! Hello everyone, I am Junel Labor. Ako po si Aimee Sue Martinez and this is K-Check the newest and smartest game show on Philippine television. We search all over the country for people na hindi nagsasawang dagdagan ang kanilang kaalaman. Titignan natin kung ang gaano katindi ang kanilang brain power. And in the final week of the competition, malalaman natin kung sino ang kauna-unahang tatanghaling K-Check champion. Apat na contestants ang dadaan sa ating karunungan check sa araw na ito. Essel is a graduate of Quezon City Science High School an incoming freshman of UP Diliman, and he and his family loves to take care of cats. Sandino is a radio DJ and a rocker who is faithfully praying to be able to continue entertaining and inspiring people. Carl is currently taking BS Business Administration in Bulacan State University. He is also a debater who likes to sing and a big fan of One Direction. Eliza is a music enthusiast who loves joining math, singing, oration, and declamation competitions. These four will be competing under the watchful eyes of today's K-Check panel of experts. Professor Wendell Capilli of the College of Arts and Letters, UP Diliman. Professor Ricky Nelias of the Institute of Chemistry, UP Diliman. And Professor Neil Santillan, chairperson of the UP Diliman Department of History. And now, contestants, papasok na tayo sa K-Check Paramihan where each correct answer is worth 10 points. This is your chance to bank as many points as you can and take the all-important early lead. Let's begin! Let's begin. Enzo, which actor is the father of twins Richard and Raymond Gutierrez? Us. Answer is Eddie Gutierrez. Sandino, in what month is Halloween celebrated? November. Male, October. Huh? <laughs> uh, Carl, in what country can you find what is left of the Berlin Wall? The Berlin Wall. Um, Russia? Male, Germany. Eliza, what potent alkaloid in coffee makes you alert and awake? Coffee. Okay, Ka check. Essel, in what country can you find the Eiffel Tower? Uh, France. Teacher, Sandino, which small marsupial from Australia looks like a teddy bear? France. <laughs> Koala. Carl, which actor is the father of fellow actors Joff, Ryan, and A.G. Eigenman? Andy Eigenman. Michael okay. DeMessa. Eliza, in what country is Mount Fuji the highest mountain? Japan. Okay, check. Essel, what does the N in the acronym ASEAN stand for? National. Male. Nations. Sandino, in what country can you find the Grand Canyon? Pass. United States. Carl, in what month do we celebrate Rizal Day? Rizal Day. December. Okay, check. Eliza, Mamba and Python are types of what reptile? Snake. K-Check. And that's it for the round one of K-Check. Eliza, I heard you love competitions. You must be gunning to win the show. Yes, I'm very much competitive. <laughs> what was the last show or competition that you actually participated in? Um, I recently participated in a uh, cooking competition. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yes, and I just learned it from watching YouTube. Oh. And it's my first time and I am actually happy and blessed to be one of the participants. Mm -hmm. oh. Ikaw, sa ang competition ka pinaka nakilala, Miss Aimee? Marami. Oh, yung pinaka. Hindi lang isa. Yung pinaka na talaga. Hindi <laughs> ko sasabihin. <laughs> B 
Binibining Pilipinas. Nag binibining Pilipinas si Miss Amy. Ikaw, Sandino, nabalitaan ko na ikaw ay isang radio DJ. Ano yung pinakamalungkot na, na kantang na pinatugtog mo sa ere? Okay. Pinakamalungkot? Uh, it might be you, I guess. <laughs> mm, may hugot. Bakit it might be you? Uh, siguro currently, uh, yun ang situation namin ng aking special someone. Mm. Oh, yeah. God. Na kay naman oh, 'yon. Oh. Unrequited love. Showbiz. Na. <laughs> showbiz, <a> showbiz. <laughs> Unrequited love, I tell you. Let us now do a recap for round one. On the lead is Eliza with 30 points, followed by Essel and Carl with 10 points. Sandino, you have to work harder, honey. <laughs> Kayo, ilang tanong ang nasagot nyo? Oo nga, siguro ako mga nasa seven yung sagot ko wow. ngayon. Oo. At ready na ba kayong lahat for our pabilisan round? Next here on K-Check! K-Check. Tuloy pa rin ang ating karunungan check. At ngayon, nanguna si Eliza with 30 points. Sunod si Estel and si Carl with 10 points each. At si Sandino ay hahabol. Prof. Neil, may tanong ka raw kay Carl. Yeah, batid ko na mahilig si Carl sa debate at pagkanta. Pwede bang magpasampol na kumakanta na nakikipagdebate? <laughs> um, wait lang. Parang hindi ko pa po natatry yan ever. Pero, how, when, when you're debating po kasi it's most commonly monotonous. Singing is very dynamic. So I'll try. So, um, Mr. Chair and members of this house, no, I can't. <laughs> Carl, yun nga yung level up na challenge. Kasi yung K-check, yeah. kagalingan check, kasi yun yung hilig mo. Yeah. Okay, babato ko ulit kay, ano, kay Prof. Neil. Diba? Feeling ko kaya ni Prof. Neil. Totoo. Kayang-kaya ano? yan. Hindi, wala akong ganong claim eh. Oh, wala ba? Sorry, <laughs> intro. Kayang naman. <laughs> Professor Wendell, sa so round one, are the contestants up to your expectations? I think they need to shape up a little bit because largely, I think, kulang sila sa konting energy para taasan nila yung mga puntos na dapat sana na panaluna nila. I think also this is a very young panel compared to the past few panels that we had. The batch of, this is a very, very young, maybe one of the youngest as a batch. So I think medyo nahihiya pa sila. But I'm confident that in the next two rounds, they'll be able to catch up. Narinig niyo yun, mga contestants laban. We're now going into K-Check Pabilisan. Buzz in first for the right to answer the question. Correct answers are worth 20 points. Pero sa round na ito, minus 10 points ang maling sagot. Kaya contestants, think before you press that buzzer. Let's begin! <music> Let us now begin round two. The first question, coming from the Greek term meaning without blood, what do you call the condition in which you lack enough healthy red blood cells to carry adequate oxygen to your body's tissues? SL, A check. Next question, which actor played the role of James Bond in the 2021 film No Time to Die? Craig, Essel. Craig Thomas. Male. Carl. James Bond. Male. Sayang, ang tamang sagot ay Daniel Craig. In poetry, how many lines does a sonnet often often contain? Eliza? 14. Gay check. Which 2.7 kilometer long bridge separates the Pacific Ocean from San Francisco Bay? The, go the Golden Gate Bridge. Gay check. Which founder of the Cubist art movement had a blue period and a rose period early in the 20th century? Pablo Carl. Picasso. K-Check. Which Olympic sport is divided into Greco-Roman and freestyles? Ang tamang sagot ay wrestling. Writer, 
J.M. Barry created a young boy who flies and lives on the island of Neverland. What is the name of this boy who never grows up? <coughs> Ethel. Sa Peter Pan. Okay, check. What do you call the dried meat of a coconut from which coconut oil is extracted? The correct answer is copra. Next question. What do you call the legendary Irish little man who may lead you to a pot of Essel. Leprechaun. Okay, check. In which 2010 animated film were little yellow creatures called minions introduced? Essel. Despicable me. Okay, check. Second to the last question. Which country's flag depicts a red circle on a white background? Esso. Japan. Okay, check. Last question. Which 2018 film soundtrack did the song Shallow by Lady <coughs> Carl? Born to be a star. A star. Eliza. A star is born. Okay, check. <laughs> and that's the end of our K check Pabilisan round. <laughs>
Prof. Neil? What is the name of the biggest food and beverage manufacturing company based on gross revenue in the Philippines in 2020? Carl, San Miguel Corporation. Mali. Ilan sa mga produkto nito ay Milo, Nes, uh, Nesty, Nescafe, and Bear Brand. Ang tamang sagot ay Nestle Philippines. Thank you. Prof. Randall. With some 500 chocolatiers in residence, which European city is dubbed as the chocolate capital of the world? City, hindi country, city. Got I Brussels. Belgian chocolates are known to be the best chocolates in the world. Thank you, Prof. Ricky. What do you call the study of the relationship between the environment and the living communities? Carl, ecology. Ito yung relationship na kailangan nating magpay attention para pwede pa tayong manirahan sa planeta ito. Paycheck ecology. Prof. Neil. Ano ang pinakabagong probinsya sa Pilipinas? Dating bahagi ng probinsya ng Davao Occidental, ah, no, Davao del Sur, okay? Ang tamang sagot ay Davao Occidental. Prof. Wendell? Which Filipino architect is known as the father of Philippine landscape architecture? His body of works includes the landscaping of the Cultural Center of the Philippines, San Miguel Corporation, and Rizal Park. Ang kanyang pangalan ay si national artist I.P. Santos or El Difonso Santos. Prof. Ricky. The interaction between charges is determined by a fundamental law that states that like charges repel and opposite charges attract. Eliza. No attraction. Male. And opposite charges attract. Either repulsion or attraction implies that force is exerted on either of the charges that are interacting. What is this non-contact type of force called? Correct answer is electrostatic force. Prof. Neil. What city in Metro Manila is located in a valley? Essel. Marikina. So, tawag, uh, tanyag rin siya bilang shoe capital ng Pilipinas. Ang tamang sagot ay Marikina k -check. Prof. Wendell. Ang tanong, which playwright produced the greatest quantity of ancient Greek comedy? Parang napakahirap sa kanila to. Ang sagot ay Aristophanes. Prof. Ricky? What mode of inheritance best explains the gene control over the expression of black and white stripes among zebras. The correct answer is codominance. Prof. Neil. Huling tanong, which United States president used benevolent assimilation as a justification in colonizing the Philippines? hindi talaga benevolent assimilation kasi nagbigay daan ito sa madugong digma ang Pilipino-Amerikano. Ang tamang sagot ay William McKinley. Thank you so much, Prof. Neil. And that's it for K-Check Ultimate Pagalingan.
And that's it for K-Check Ultimate Pagalingan. Congratulations to Essel, our K-Check Daily winner, Congrats. with a final score of 180 points. We'll see Essel again tomorrow when he competes with our daily winners for a spot in our semifinals. Thanks to Sandino, Carl, and Eliza for joining, to the members of our panel of experts, Professor Wendell, Professor Ricky, and Professor Neil. This is Amy Sue Martinez. And I am Junelle Bor. Join us again tomorrow for another K-Check! K -Check.